to use or does we really want a father-daughter relationship with him? You know, we only ever see Peter in what he wants to accomplish and when he's being manipulative and how he treats people. So I have to imagine the rest of his life and when he's sitting alone and what he thinks about it is and, and if he didn't love her and want a relationship he would kind of be a one-dimensional monster and that to me is not a very exciting character we don't have time to show him having those moments with her and, and to see him like that but I believe that it is there so yes he does want all those things he does want to cultivate he does want to be close to her he does want to be loved I mean he's a human being um, I don't know if he was bitten or born do you guys know that all of them? I should probably know that. Okay, so he is a wolf, but he's still human, so just, don't you get it? Like, it wouldn't be fun if, if, he, was, if he didn't care about his daughter, because then he'd just be an asshole. So, he could be a crappy father, but we still, you know, he has to feel that compassion for her. So, I, in my mind, I have those moments with her, and then we just shoot the scenes where he's just being manipulative. Okay, and then what did you think about Styles being with Malia? Because Peter has always been annoyed by Styles. Um, he is annoyed, but it's, you know how like your, your, your older siblings like give you a hard time and they're annoyed and they beat you up and stuff? And they do it because they really like you and love you and, and that's how they show affection. Mm -hmm. I think Peter really adores Styles, and he is the only person at Beacon Hills that he wants to have Malia be with. He's the only one that's good enough for her. He's, yeah, he might. He would. He would love her to be with Scott, but Scott's a wolf, so he. I think he wants her to be with Styles. So I think Peter loves Styles and wants to protect him, even though they have that answer back and forth. That just makes it fun for me. Okay, thank you. You're welcome.